What's up everybody, Kid and Roy here. So Harmony OS, which is Huawei's own operating system, has been in development for like three years. If you remember, last year Huawei officially announced its first version of the Harmony OS at the Huawei's developer conference 2019. And now that the 2020 edition of the same conference is coming, so company is expected to unveil the second version of the Harmony OS. Even though we got some news which says Huawei is planning to release a smartphone running Harmony OS this year in 2020, but now Richard Yu, the CEO of Huawei Consumer Business, officially confirms that there will be no such smartphone from the company this year. While in a meeting, Richard Yu was questioned regarding Huawei smartphone powered by Harmony OS. To this, he replied that there are no plans to release such device this year. But that does not mean it will not release next year. So in other words, he most probably meant that the smartphone is not coming this year, but next year. I know Huawei fans are badly waiting for Harmony OS, but look, introducing an operating system is not an easy deal. You have to make sure that it's not having issues and will run for long term without hurdles. And also Harmony OS was always Huawei's second choice. Android was always the first. But now circumstances are against Huawei, so they have to launch their own operating system as soon as possible in order to sell their smartphones. Anyway, I know it's a bad news, but there isn't any option except waiting for Harmony OS. Well, the Huawei's Mate 30 Pro has been around for nearly a year now, but it seems we are in for a refreshed version of it. So the Mate 30 Pro's new variant has been listed. The screen size and the resolution is almost the same with the regular Mate 30 Pro. The difference here is with the cameras. Surprisingly, the new variant is getting low camera resolutions than the regular Mate 30 Pro. For example, the front facing camera is down to 16 megapixel from 32 megapixel. And the rear cameras are also now down, so it could possibly mean that Huawei is trying to sell the same Mate 30 Pro with little decrease in the camera performance with lower price tag. So if you didn't purchase last year's Mate 30 Pro due to its high price tag, now this smartphone is for you. So yeah, what do you think about it? Do let me know your thoughts on that in the comments down below and if you somehow like this video, a sub to the channel will make my day. So as always, I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace out.